Now let's talk for this quick second and let's let's explain healing for the man and the woman. Now, a lot of people get these books, a lot of people search for knowledge, and the rabbit hole is deep. Cause you can go down many avenues and man, it'll have you jacked up. Man, you'll be thinking of, uh, you know, some some dark magic. When natural magic is the highest form of magic anyone can do because when people do this magic they depending on spirits to help them achieve this magic but see when you're doing natural magic you're not depending on nobody but the thing that's attached and connected to you like your mind see when it says natural magic you're talking about manifesting your thoughts see but the natural magic was for the pure people the dark magic was for the evil people so if you are pure, then your thoughts going to manifest all your actions, and that's going to be your universe. Now, let's get back to man and woman. Now, it's a big stumbling blocks that placed in between the true man and the true woman because together they are powerful. They are very, very powerful. You break them apart, they are weak. It's like your fingers. I can slap you right now. You might get back up. But if I put my fist together and punch you, then it's different. It's a totally different punch. Totally different hit. Because why it's together. So when you bring these real men and real women together, it's called the powerhouse. Something this world really don't want to see. But we are confused because we don't know how to have our spiritual intercourse a lot of us know how to have physical intercourse a lot of people can have sex many different ways many different times but we don't know nothing about spiritual intercourse because the spirit is what's going to really bring life so when you talk about spiritual intercourse you are talking about the woman opening up to the man and the man able to penetrate the woman's mind and birth what new information that's going to transform this world that's the only way man and woman will receive healing. This is facts. I don't know if this is in the book. Uh, but these are facts, y'all. You know, we're not going to be healed no other way. Uh, when you're speaking of mankind, you are speaking of Adam, the man and woman. You know, that's why one man has man in it. Man. So we are the same. But we got two different roles. And once we truly learn how to play our roles in the spirit, then we can manifest this fleshly body that's taking over our minds. So we just trying to turn it around. Our mind gonna take out our body. You know, we're gonna let this come from the top, we're gonna let it flow down all the way to our feet so we can get on our what? Soul purpose. So with that being said, brothers and sisters, man, I hope you got the message. This is what's gonna bring healing to the true woman and the true man. Some of us call us black, but I don't really don't like to call us black. Call me a child of light. Um, anything but really black. I hope the far that circumcised your heart and ears for the message, peace and blessings, and I'm out.